Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. This is James in Nashville, and let's look at some Fear the Walking Dead stuff, some Madison stuff. This info is coming from an Entertainment Weekly article. I'll leave the link down in the description below. It is an interview with both showrunners Goldberg and Chambliss, and spoiler alert if you're not caught up to Season 7 of Fear the Walking Dead. So Entertainment Weekly asked the question, we saw the trailer scene that you put out with the return of Madison, so what can you say about that in terms of where she is and who is there with her? Goldberg says, well, she looked like she had some new tattoos to me. And look, without giving too much away, she's in a very different place than when we left her in the middle of season four at the stadium. Madison has been on quite a journey since then, as have all of our characters. And we're really just excited. Kim, I know, has spoken in interviews about this being Madison 2.0, and it really is. It is an evolution and a redefinition of Madison Clark. And it's going to be fantastic, and we're excited to reintroduce her to both fans and into the world of fear as she kind of interacts with characters we haven't seen her interact with before. So then they ask, well, how much is she going to be in Season 7? Is it going to be like Lauren Cohen coming back to The Walking Dead? How much is Kim in this season? And Chamless answered, she's going to be returning in a way that will impact the end of Season 7 and have huge ripples going into Season 8. But that's not to say when we see her this season that it will be in a small role. It'll be in a very big, impactful way. EW asks, whether this is in Season 7 or Season 8, is your plan to tell what happened in this gap of time in which we have not seen her or to show it in flashbacks? How are you approaching the big gap that we're going to have here? Goldberg answered, we're not taking anything off the table between flashbacks and talking about it in the present. There's obviously a lot of story to tell there, and we have a lot of ideas for how we're going to tell it, so maybe a little of both. So that was it for the article that they gave us. They may give us some more in an extended interview or something like that later, but uh, pretty much what they said is there is an extended amount of time in between, of course, that we have seen Madison when she gets to the end of Season 8, but the possible flashback of what we saw in the promo still could be farther back in time but yet after the stadium because she does have the new tattoos so what's what's all that about we didn't really get a lot of info but at least we got a little better hint i guess on the timing of how it may play out fear the walking dead returns next sunday the 17th with a couple episodes on amc plus madison's return probably won't be till the end but they say it'll be in a big, impactful way. So let me know what you think about it all down in the comments below. And of course, I will join you there. This is James in Nashville. As always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more dead stuff.